Hi, this is Francis from Easel. Today, we're going to be talking through how to use the Easel Image Trace feature. Basically, this feature allows you to take JPEG images or, or image files and upload them into the Image Trace, and then Easel will convert them into a vector file uh, uh, to be carved in Easel. Um, there are some caveats with using this. Um, I think probably the biggest one or the one that we, we see a lot when troubleshooting is, is the image trace feature will work with uh, like color JPEGs, like pictures or photographs. It, it will kind of convert those, but for the most part, it works best with high contrast black and white images. Um, that's because the contrast makes it really easy for the trace to kind of uh, achieve what it's trying to do. So typically we recommend limiting uh, image trace feature to high contrast black and white images um, because that's where you're going to see the best results. Um, so we'll kind of talk through what that looks like or, or how, to, how to do the image trace feature. I'm going to pop in here and show you. You can click on the upload file on the left hand side once you've opened an easel project. You'll get a drop down menu. One of the options will be image trace. I'm going to select that. And then I'm going to click on the upload file in the image trace uh, window that opens up here. And then there'll be another window that opens up. I'll select the center of that and then I'll pick my JPEG file. Here I have a, a high contrast black and white JPEG file. I'm going to open that. I'll see my image listed here and then I'll click on upload. And then we can see kind of a preview of what my image is going to look like. You can see right here, I'm kind of missing part of the, the design. So I'm going to adjust the threshold a little bit to see if I can get some of that design back. Looks like I'm getting there. Let's try it. Let's try 74. Yep, that looks like I got most of my image. Uh, again, you can kind of adjust the threshold and the smoothing depending on what your image looks like here in the uh, image trace feature. And then uh, you can choose to invert it uh, if you want to, and that'll change uh, the kind of black and white in each. I'm going to keep it the way it was. Uh, and you can choose to trace the outlines, um, and then it'll just give you uh, outlines instead of kind of carve points or, or pocket carves. Uh, I'm going to keep it the way it is. I'll select import, and now my um, file has been imported and if I adjust it we can see that my JPEG file was converted and then uploaded. Um, that's how you use the uh, easel image trace feature. Uh, have a wonderful day. To learn more head over to easel.com.